What is going on everybody? Welcome to the new year. We are officially in 2020 and I thought I was going to start my diet and uh, you know I thought about it and then I thought some more on it, pondered on it and then I, I thought of donuts and I thought of pizza and I thought of making a video. <laughs> Guys I'm not going on any diet. Um, what was it called? Um, I, I, I kind of have no idea, but I just want to say give a big shout out to our sponsors of this video for one Thank you for clicking on this video. Make sure to give it a like share and subscribe to the channel if you're new. I love you um, But one the coldest water company sponsoring each and every video that I do appreciate them They have these great 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 insulated water bottles that you guys can actually enter a giveaway if you want to they do one every week and then you can click on the link in my bio to get yours so but for all you men out there that are looking to get a new skincare product or an expert with skincare product have used it before have not used one you can't find one you want one that's custom to you go through geology guys geology has a trial 30 day trial you can use start 20 right now to get it for twenty dollars and what it does is it's 30 days you get two morning face washes um, you get two in the night face washes, everyday face washes, and you also get some eye nourishing cream too. So it's great for people that have, you know, acne, they have sensitive skin, they have wrinkles, all of those things. If you are in need of a skincare product, this is the thing that you, definitely for you. So ch check out Geology. The link's in my description. Again, guys, you can check it out. You start 20, click on the link, get your own custom skincare product. I use one in the shower for my everyday morning wash and then I keep one out by my sink that I use to wash my face. And then the nourishing cream at night and then there's a nourishing um, eye cream that you can use for people that have bags like myself because I have bad allergies and real bad allergies. And then there's a morning face cream that you can use so it doesn't dry out your skin. So check them out guys, they work with Men's Health Magazine. There's tons of reviews if you want to check them out first before you go in, but such a great product. Cannot say bad things about them. So without further ado, enough talking about products. Thank you for clicking on the video. My name is Keith Buholtz. This is 2020. I'm sorry for the delay on the video too. This has been a little bit of a hassle, but I've been working a lot and having a lot of fun too. So um, appreciate you guys. Like, share, and subscribe. Welcome to my channel if you're new. And I'll see you through the rest of the video. Bada bing, bada boom. What's going on everybody? Welcome back to my channel. Hopefully you are doing well. Uh, today is gonna be something a little different. We're gonna be doing sweet versus savory foods. My voice sounds weird. It says I went to the Houston Texans game yesterday and I lost it. Sort of. I still have it, but I lost it. I'm, I'm gonna try to do some of the meals where there's some savory, some sweet foods. I've never done this, so and you guys have asked me for this video for a while. Sweet for savory foods. This is gonna be the first video of 2020. Let's go try some new stuff that are in, and let's go enjoy this cheat day. Well, guys, it's a no-go on Duncan. Their window is down. I don't feel like going in because I don't have shoes on. I got flip-flops. Hi, can I get one of your five dollar famous uh, bowls? Uh, the Richard? meal or just the bowls? I'll do the meal. Okay. And uh, what's gonna be the the drink? Can I do um, Diet Pepsi, please? Diet Pepsi? Yes, please. Okay. Anything else? That'll be it. Five forty one. Please pull up this here. Thank you. Hi, welcome to Krispy Kreme. What can I get for you? Hello, can I get, uh, I'm going to do three donuts. Okay. Can I do one of your Oreo cookie donuts? We actually don't do that one right now. We just ordered the cookies. Oh, gotcha. Can I do then, I'm going to do one of the chocolate ice with cream filling. Okay. And then I'll do a strawberry sprinkled. All right, and the other one? And then do you guys have any apple fritters in? No, sir. Uh, I'll do then strawberry, uh, powdered strawberry filled. Okay, so you have a chocolate ice, a cream filling, a strawberry ice, and then the powdered strawberry? Yep. Anything else? That'd be it. $3.89. It's 
time to eat. If you guys like my little lit dabbing on a teddy bear uh, shirt, I just got it recently. <laughs> Thought I'd show you guys. I got donuts, so we got donuts. This looks so good. We also got some Kentucky Fried Chicken. So I got the meal. I got this new famous bowl. They give you the cookie. They give you. They hook you up, pretty much. So check this thing out, man, guys. It looks so good. KFC bowl. This is a famous bowl, I guess. This is my first meal of 2020, guys. How's your 2020 on? So, I'm a personal trainer, and my gym has been nuts because New Year's resolution. You can do that in a year. But I get people that want to do it. Uh, you know, I understand. But man, I want to take you guys through my upcoming videos. This is Precision Nutrition. That's who I went through and got my, um, I'm a nutrition coach now too. But I want to take you guys through the science. This this certification took me a while to get, but I actually went through the science of the breakdown of like carbohydrates, fats, um, protein, and how your body balances energy, metabolic processes. So I want to take you guys through in one of my upcoming cheat days and show you kind of what my body does as I'm eating this food right now. It's interesting. Some of you guys are asking me too, how do you, I want to see a video of how you balance and don't gain weight. I do gain a slight amount of weight, and I lose weight too, but I'll show you guys. It smells pretty good. Five bucks, we had a drink and a cookie. Also time, I forgot to show you guys the time. 426. Let's put 24 hours in the clock. You got it girl, you got it. I usually sound better, but my stuff, my, my voice is kind of. As it gets dark out so early, it's four o'clock. And the sun's going down. That was exceptionally good. Kind of liked it. Let's eat the cookie. So that's my first savory food today. Get a little cookie. The office, man. That's what this reminds me of. Cookie, cookie. Mmm. Look at the cookies. I've been craving Tane's chicken so bad recently. The funny part for 90% of the places I'm going today, I have a gift card <laughs> for Christmas. Yeah, hooked up guys. Donut time! Let's eat this powdered one because I know it's going to be messy. Mm. Look at that. If I could get it to focus, that'd be so nice. Well, it's good. I love those donuts, but man, they're messy. One of the best. I like it because it's so simple. Ice with cream filling, baby. This one's good. Yeah. 
One day it'll focus. That was pretty good. I'm gonna total up my uh, my thoughts and my opinions at the end when I do all the foods. That was not bad. Guys, I know it's super dark out, but check out this truck. It is sick. It is so hot. Oh my gosh, look at this line, guys. The canes on a Sunday. Chicken hot chicken, which combo are you picking? Hi, can I get the box combo, please? And the drink? I'm gonna do Diet Coke. For the Diet Coke, awesome. And that'll be it. 835, thank you. Thank you. Alright guys, so welcome into the next meal. Um, I had no idea these actually even existed. But I'm kind of excited that they do. I'm really stoked. This is a lot of nachos. This is the party pack at Taco Bell. Also got some canes, so. Um, yeah, this is um, a lot of food. All right, so I'm gonna dive in. I got some Cinnabon um, delights too, but I got I definitely gotta go with Canes first. I got this a while back, and uh, it's definitely probably warm or cold. <laughs> but let me show you guys the time: 19 hours, 57 minutes. That's how much we have left. I'm gonna show you. Not as cold as I thought. Oh, cane sauce, so good. You guys haven't had canes, you need to change that. Mmm. Mmm. Bread. <laughs> the Club Zero is so good. I think these chicken places are starting to grow on me. Canes, KFC, Popeyes. Good old Canes fries. I can't believe how many nachos they give you. That's chicken. Oh, 
like to every once in a while try the pulse off, see if it's good for the day. Not not a huge coleslaw fan. I'm not feeling it today. Coleslaw does not remind me of like a cheat day food at all. All right, we got these nachos. I'm gonna go about eating all this. It's good. I'm curious if these are spicy jalapenos. I hope not. I'm gonna have to get down and dirty with this one. I just can't believe this is for like a party. It's a lot of nachos, but... I guess it depends on who you have coming over. guacamole on it too. I'm curious if I'm gonna run out of toppings. Alright guys, so I'm gonna use this fork. They gave me like six forks. So, um, to kind of put this together. Oh, I don't like the sound. I'm trying to get it to where all the meat, everything is like in one spot. Number eight notches with a spoon. You know, I think the they give you a little too many chips. The topping is almost enough. That's a lot of chips. That's what I've come to notice after eating this. It's not bad. I like it. It's like five to six nacho ball grandes, but. Alright guys, before I get burned out on these nachos, <laughs> I'm gonna go into my desserts. So I got these Cinnabon, I love these things. These things are so good. Oh, yeah. Where the focus point is, but somewhere on the screen. These are good. I got the four pack. I swear these things get better every time I get it. I definitely don't want any more nachos. I just huge chips left. But yeah, I got saying. Oh, 85%, so not bad, pretty good. All right, beautiful people, I'm currently here right outside McDonald's. Oh, what just happened? Um, but yeah, I'm about to go get, I just got two apple pies, because I'm just gonna go for desserts for tonight. It's nachos, man, they kind of filled me up a little bit. All right, guys, in with the next meal. It is late, <laughs> like I need to eat this. I got these brownies from my client that I'm about to show you right now. Cover it up as I go. 
So yeah guys, we're gonna just indulge in these, see how it tastes. I'm gonna try one, like a bite out of, ooh, it's kinda hard. Maybe I gotta pick it up. Ooh, it's chocolate rich. This was also gifted to me by a client. <laughs> oh good. Mm. I got some baked apple pies. Ooh, they're warm. So I'm gonna eat a little more brownies and then I'm gonna um, catch some sleep. Actually, I got shower and then catch some sleep. But um, yeah, these brownies are actually really good. It's like a big chunk. Mm. It's soft. I'm gonna catch some sleep. I'll see you guys tomorrow for the rest of this video. All right, guys, just got out of work. About to order a check. -ass. Can I get uh, one of your fry lover burgers? Can I do no onion on that? Yes, sir. And then I'm gonna do one of the big Buford combos. I'm gonna do no onion on that as well, please. You said the big Buford combo? Yes, please. Yes, sir. Uh, and no onions? Yeah, no onions. Yes, sir. Put a drink? I'm going to do Diet Coke, please. Yes, sir. And then I'm just going to do two apple pies. Yes, sir. And that's it. Alright guys, welcome into uh, the next thing I'm actually doing terrible on this cheat day um, because it's later than 4 o'clock I actually end up having to work a full day but that does not mean I'm going to stop doing this cheat day just because I'm past time and I'm doing terrible with time I still want to get more in this cheat day but it's not 24 hours I mean it's the next day, it's just a little bit later than 4 so that's fine with me, I'm going to continue, I'm hungry um, I can keep eating, so we're gonna enjoy this cheat day, guys. I'm gonna show you guys, this is a fry burger. We went with checkers, and I got more apple pies, because I love their apple pies. I'm gonna try to see if it beats out their regular food, though. So they got good right too. So, fry burger. Let's call the fried lover burger. Boom. I almost got it on my shirt after I did. <laughs> I tried to be clean. Boom. What a burger, spicy ketchup for the fries. I love Tucker's fries plain, but also I'm a huge fan of ketchup. You know? Like, who's not? I hope you all love ketchup. 
This fries are so good. <laughs> It's hard to explain Chinese fries. They're just like, mm. everybody's got to experience them. Why are my ears so red? One of my possible favorite things on their menu, the Big Buford. This is definitely probably my favorite thing on their menu. Besides fries, the apple pies are good too. So I'm kind of curious. How that's gonna play up against the big beeper. It's so good. Every time. Last bite. Next we got these wonderful looking apple pies. Now they're coated in cinnamon sugar, so I'm kind of scared of how to eat it. I want to just take a bite out of it and then just go everywhere. That's like not what I want to do. Not bad, it didn't go everywhere. Mmm. Bro, these apple pies, man. They're one of a kind. Like all of you beautiful people. Mmm. Oh, so best. We dominate apple pies from McDonald's. Baby, you. <laughs> when you say you're just a pie. Every ounce of cardio I gotta do after this. Alright guys, rolling into the last meal of this cheat day challenge, whatever you wanna call it. Um, sweet versus savory. I'm about to add up the votes pretty soon after this, you guys will see. I want you guys to take the first look at the pizza just like I always do. Let me know how it looks. Actually, you really can't let me know how it looks, but. And I also got this pasta. Cause there's that deal. Ooh, it's really hot. It's really hot. Check this out, guys. This is the pasta. Good. It's really hot though. Kind of like cool down for a little bit. This pizza looks crazy good. Double cheese. Mmm. Mmm. What kind of sauce did I get? Did I get any sauce? It's like one of the most cheesiest pizza I've ever eaten. I like it though. I'm about to eat the pasta. Hopefully it's not a billion degrees. I hope I don't burn myself. Part of me feels like I'm gonna. What's not that bad? It's 
good. Some good pasta. Time to carb up. I've been craving pasta for a while. Just like there's very little sauce on it. Alright guys, got another piece of pizza. Good pizza. Dessert, baby. Got Reese's mini, mini sticks. I'm excited. I also have some more brownies if I want to eat some of those too. Ooh, look at these. I never had these. Mini stick Reese's. I wish I could find them. I don't know. Mmm. These are good. Oh, they're individually little raffles. Not a big Three Musketeers fan, but these are birthday cake. I didn't really take. Oh, wait, I can taste this. These are good. I like these. You got a strong flavor, I like it. I'm gonna have one more of these Reese's though. I love Reese's. Alright guys, welcome into the last meal. I'm all shaved up and ready to go. It feels so good to actually have I don't know, I like having a, a baby face, as I would say. Um, but last meal of this crazy sweet burst savory, I made one of my goals to use less paper this um, this year, because you guys are always getting into me about it. So guys, I got Chick-fil-A. The fries get cold so fast. It's like it would be so quick. I got the sauce. And I got this chicken sandwich. I also got Chipotle. I don't do Chipotle very often for my cheat days. But I also switched my headband for this Lakers headband, or what's called beanies. Chipotle sauce. Mm. So good. So, it's gonna be all this food against peanut butter brownies. This is some good food, but peanut butter brownies are so good. Chick-fil-A sauce. about waffle fries that separates them from regular fries. The 
is muy bien. Check out this, guys. This is a deluxe. Ooh, the cheese is like melted. Let's put Chick fil A sauce all over it. <laughs> if I could get the top. Check this out. Sauce. This sauce is no joke. It's so good. Some people would probably think that's not enough. Mmm. So fresh. It was well worth every penny of that gift card. Oh man, look at this. Now this accidentally dropped on my way walking in. Oh man, that looks good. <laughs> Where's the fork? That's probably covered in cheese. Because I accidentally, like I said, dropped it on my way walking in the house. I'm excited. This looks good. Cheddar cheese. Chili cheese, I mean. I always taste so salty though. I'm in love with the salt. I hope this burrito sticks together, I really don't think it's gonna. But, I'm not gonna have a negative mindset about it. Kind of look crazy the way he wrapped it. We'll see though, you never know. It's a pretty big burrito, I think it's already falling apart. How am I gonna go about this? So, strategically, I think I'm just gonna eat it upside down. I don't know if that's the best. I've eaten Chipotle burritos before, but I knew this one was going to be one of the toughest ones. The goal is to spill none of it. <laughs> I'm going to have to eat like corn on the cob. It's getting more difficult. <laughs> the more I eat. Here we go. It's about to turn into a bowl. Eat this bowl. <laughs> oh, what's left in my burrito? All right, guys, time to eat these brownies on this plastic plate because you guys are always giving me about my paper plate. So, yeah doesn't affect me or anything, no, I'm just kidding. I do, I want to be more um, environmental conscious. So, these are still warm. Mm. Mm. With the peanut butter, it's a whole different kind of game.
I love it. It's so good. This is some of the best runs I think I've had in a long time. Like, God, look at that. Wow, oh, man. It's love. That's what love looks like. Last brownie. I'm super stoked. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Let's go. This beanie's rolling off my head. <sighs> I've just been so full. <laughs> Last bite. That is all she wrote, my friends. <laughs>